Hello mga lods, welcome to this channel Bracing Nifty. My name is Roel. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, share with your friends, comment down below, subscribe to this channel, and turn on that notification bell so that you will get notified every time I posted a new video just for you. So from here, kung yung negative 3.89 natin habang lumalaki yung value nung Z papunta dun sa positive, lumalaki din yung area na nakukover niya. So kanina, pag yung Z natin from negative papunta doon sa Z which is equal to 0, nang nakukover niya 0.5 of the whole area. While nag increase yung ating Z, nagiging positive 1, 2, 3, hanggang doon sa dulo kanina sa table which is 3.89, nakukover niya yung 0.9999 nung area which is almost all areas under this normal curve so nagi which is approximately going to 1 so yun yung ibig sabihin nung mga values dito sa table na ito yung area nito so we have discussed earlier about the central limit theorem the standard score and we are now ready for our example. So the population mean of the annual salary by agriculture is, is 512,000. The standard deviation is 192,000. And a random sample of 50 agriculturists was selected from this population. So take note from that problem, meron na tayong given uh, population mean, meron tayong standard deviation, and meron tayong value ni n which is equal to 50. So, ang tanong, what is the probability that the mean salary is, letter A, mean salary is less than 450,000? Letter B, the mean salary is more than 500,000? And for letter C, the mean salary is between 514,000 and 518,000. We are looking at the probability of the mean salary. So, tinitingnan natin yung area na na-cover ng mean salary na less than 450,000. So, paano natin makuha yon? O paano natin malaman yung probability o yung area na na-covered by a mean salary which is equal to or less than 450,000? Kailangan natin kunin yung Z or standard score ng mean salary na 450,000 saka natin nahanapin yung area na na-cover niya doon sa table. So that will be the probability of the mean salary of less than 450,000. So try natin isolve yung ating or pakita yung ating solution for dito. Ayan. So solution for the probability that the mean salary is less than 450,000. So, ang first thing to do is to solve for Z. Solve for Z. Meron tayong formula for Z kanina, which is equal to mean nung sample minus mu over mu is the mean of the population. Then we have divided by the standard deviation of the population over square root of n which is the number of sample which is equal to is a substitute lang natin yung ating mean salary mean of the sample which is 450,000 minus yung mean ng ating population which is 512,000 divided by Yung standard deviation ng ating population 192 over square root ni 50. Okay? So, by simplifying these values, take note na si 450 minus 512,000. 450,000 minus 512,000. Nagkakaroon tayo ng negative na value dyan. So, since negative yung ating numerator, divided by a denominator, which is 192,000 divided by the square root of 50, magkakaroon tayo ng negative na value ni Z. In this case, after simplifying all these values, magkakaroon tayo ng negative 2.2833. But since 
doon sa ating table, meron lang tayong 2 decimal places. So, ang mahanap natin doon is negative 2.28. So, if Z is equal to negative 2.28, saan siya? Ang area ni Z, which is equal to negative 2.28, below that, which is equal to the probability of Z, less than negative 2.28 is equal to kung titingnan natin doon sa table balikan natin yon negative 2.2 tayo doon sa negative na side okay negative 2.28 so sa row ni negative 2.2 eto at doon sa column ng 8 eto yon Okay, para makita nyo, ayan. Negative 2.2 na row at sa column na 0.08. So, that is negative 2.28 which is equal to 0.0113. Okay? Ayan. So, kung babalikan natin doon, ang value nito is 0. 0.0113. Ito yun. 0.0113. So, anong big sabihin nitong probability of Z less than negative 2.28 which is equal to 0.0113. Kung titingnan natin, yung 0.0113, si pagpalagay natin dito, pagpalagay natin si Z nandito which is equal to si 450,000, si 450,000, ang standard score niya is negative, negative 2.28. Negative 2.28 ang standard score ni 450,000. So, yung area na na-cover nitong Z less than negative 2.28 is this one. Ito. Itong area nito, Eto, okay, for solution B, uh, with the problem, what is the probability that the mean salary is more than 500,000? In this case, we are concerned with the area of the standard score of the 500,000, mean salary of 500,000, and above. So, ang gagawin natin dito, kailangan muna nating isolve si Z para malaman natin kung ano yung standard score nito mean salary na 500. So, Z is equal to yung ating formula, mean minus mu over standard deviation divided by square root of N. So, isubstitute lang natin mga values dyan. Meron tayong 500,000 na mean salary ng ating sample. Meron tayong mean salary of the population which is 512,000 then meron tayong standard deviation na 192,000 divided by square root of 50 so kung titignan natin si 500,000 is less than 512,000 so pag kinuha natin yung difference niyan magkakaroon tayo ng negative so negative over the positive dito sa denominator. So, we expect na si Z natin or standard score natin is equal to a negative value. So, upon simplifying these values, magkakaroon tayo ng negative, negative 0 0.44 na yan yung ating magiging value ni Z. Or that is the standard score of a mean salary of 500 which is equal to negative 0.44. Now, ito, hahanapin natin yung area nito doon sa table. Pero yung mahanap natin na area ni Z which is equal to negative 0.44 is yung area na ito. Ang makukuha natin is si Z less than negative 0.44. Yan yung makuha natin doon sa table. Kasi yan yung area na binibigyan ng table. Yung area niya, 
Say for example, nandito si 500,000. Do-draw tayo ng line. Draw natin yung line kung sa nasaan si 500,000. So say for example, itong green na line is nandiyan si 500,000. Then ang Z niyan is negative 0 0.44. So, ang ibibigay doon sa table na area o ng probability is itong shaded part na ito on the left side. Okay, yan. Ang bibigay niya. Ngayon, ang concern natin is ang gustong malaman is yung mean salary of more than 500,000. So, kung titingnan natin dito sa graph, sa normal graph, ang gusto nating malaman is yung ito na area. Ito yun. Yung Z greater than negative 0 0.44. Okay? Yan yung gusto nating malaman. Yung probability niyan. Paano natin makukuha yung probability ng Z greater than negative 0 0.44? Kailangan muna natin makuha yung area nito. And take note that yung area ng buong normal distribution is equal to 1. So kapag meron na tayong value nito, ibabawas lang natin ito doon sa buong area which is equal to 1 para makuha natin yung area ni probability of Z greater than negative 0 0.44. So doon sa table, hanapin muna natin yung area nito ni Z less than negative 0 0.44. Okay? Which is equal to, okay? So babalikan nyo yung table, makikita nyo, ang area nyan is 0. 3, 3, 0, 0. Ngayon, ang kukunin natin o hinahanap doon sa problem, yung solution ng B, is the probability that the mean salary is more than 500,000. We are concerned with the probability of Z greater than negative 0 0.44, which is equal to 1 minus eto yung probability ng Z na less than. So, ibabawas natin yan. 0, 0 0.3300. 0. So, that is 1 minus 0 0.33 is 0 0.67. Ito na yung ating sagot. Or, that is just 67%. O yung probability that Z is greater than negative 0.44 is equal to 0.67. Ito na ngayon. Ito yun. Ayan. So, yan yung sagot.